it's it's one of the most important you know federal resources available to us in, in the world of conservation I'm Kevin Bixby and this is the Southwest Environmental Center I'm the executive director here here in Las Cruces I just know it's it's tremendously important it's a, as a source of funding to set aside conservation lands and parks but you know I'm primarily interested in in wild areas and natural landscapes and it's just so critical that we that we protect these areas before they're lost and so uh, you know we need that that fund to see how New Mexico has benefited from its public lands and its parks one only has to look to our neighbor to the east Texas where there is ver there's very there are very few public lands here in New Mexico um, much of the state is open to going out and hiking and hunting and camping and enjoying the outdoors, connecting with nature, watching wildlife. I think public lands are like libraries or public schools. They're, they're just these, these uh, public goods that whether you avail yourselves of them or not, they benefit society. They change us for the better. Um, you know, biologists say uh, more and more that we need to set aside half of the world as wildlife preserves. And we're only at maybe 5%, 10% in the United States. So we have a lot of work to do. And without money behind the, the project, it's not going to get finished. Well, I think um, it would put an end to. Um, the unfinished project of protecting natural landscapes for everybody and for future generations. Without that source of funding, there would there would be no more acquisitions, and we would be, you know, we have a good um, uh, asset base now of public lands, but there would be no adding to it, and we need to add to it. People need parks, and parks need people. We need to save the fund. <laughs> Yeah,